Hey everybody, this is Joyce Chow for MB Anna News Video Web. We're here with Hayden. Hayden Begley. Yep. Definitely. Okay, I have to ask you growing up, this is about on Begley Street, and your dad always thought of him as being Mr. Green. Growing up in a household like that and watching them go through building the house, do you have any um, insight for other kids with parents that want to go green? Uh, definitely. I mean, it's it's not easy. Definitely. Growing up in a house that is totally green, you have to watch what you do. A lot of things we do um, unaware of what we're doing, you know, leaving the lights on, leaving the power strip on, leaving the TV on. And so uh, at first it was a little like shocking because I saw how my friends lived, you know, they could leave the TV on. I go, why can't we leave the TV on? It's because we know about these things and uh, it's knowledge that is power in this. And so he, uh, he knows about it, I know about it. So it's kind of like it would be, kind of makes us feel a little bad about it. But I, uh, a lot of my friends, I feel like uh, they have been in my house and you know seen a lot of things that um, we have done and hopefully have gotten something out of it and I think um, I think it's going to be even better with the new house and everything that we've worked for is going to pay off and I'm really excited. You've been watching them go through all of this so what are you looking forward to most at the new home? Oh what am I looking forward to most? Probably uh, I love the landscape of the property is just beautiful with the trees and uh, we're going to have even more, um, you know, be able to grow more plants and vegetables and, you know, fruits and stuff like that. And then also the pool is going to be great. I think it's all just going to be really wonderful. I'm excited. Do you have any advice for kids your age about being or becoming green? I, um, what I would say for kids who want to become green at my age, do the easy stuff first. My dad always says, pick the low hanging fruit, and it's so true to always just, um, you know, turn the lights off when you can. You know, get a power strip so you could just turn off one little strip instead of having to unplug because there's a lot of things called vampire power that just suck out power and it's like, um, it was like it was never even there, but it was. And um, just try simple things first. And if you get there, then you can try other things, weather stripping, more insulation. But uh, start easy, is what I say. Yeah. I heard you're also an actress as well as musician, too. <laughs> yes, definitely. I mean, growing up in my house, my dad's not only just a green guy, he's, um, you know, a very uh, well-known actor. And so he... Um, I think that I grew up in that kind of environment of growing up with a lot of actors. My mother's an actress too. Uh, and I love acting, but then I also have this other side of loving music and singing. And I've been actually working on a new thing, a couple things now with some great people, new demos and stuff like that. Yeah, and I'm really excited. I feel like you're teasing us. Can you give a little more insight into who you're working with and when it's coming out? Oh, I'm working with a great, two great people, a great uh, musician called, uh, his name's Mike Hayes, and he's um, helping kind of uh, lay the track down for me and doing a lot of instrumentals on um, the track. And then my friend uh, Melissa Harding, who is um, helping me with the vocals and stuff like that. And I'm really excited. It's coming together piece by piece, and I think it's going to be great. And of course, we have to touch on acting, which is coming up. You want to, any tips for young actors or what you're working on? Uh, my tip for uh, young actors is to just stay with it. If you really love it, uh, do what you can to get to where you want to be. Uh, put all, your all into it, you know. If it's really your passion, uh, it'll drive you there, you know. It's, uh, it really is a bug. You get bitten by the acting bug. It's just, I don't know how it happened to me, too. I totally get it. <laughs> yeah. And if we want to catch up with you on the internet about you and your acting bug and music bug and, well, of course, your very green home, um, where do we find you? I have a um, Instagram, and uh, that is at H-E-Y, hey, H-A-Y, H-A-Y, one, two, three, at hey, hey, one, two, three. Yeah, my friends came up with it a while ago but um, and then I have my vine which is just Hayden Begley and then I have a Facebook so you can add me on Facebook I'm just you know there and I'm you're doing vine okay what's the what's the vine you've done that you wish you could take back oh 
there's a couple about vampire diaries and all that kind of and kind of like weird stuff that I do with just trying to be funny. <laughs> you can go see it. It's up. It's still up there <laughs> for everyone's amusement. Yep, it's still there. Definitely. <laughs> Hayden, thank you so very much. Thank you.